This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. A 67-year-old registered sex offender has been arrested. Bud Christensen is accused of killing an Iranian exchange student more than 35 years ago. Firze de Hagenpour was a student at UNO when her body was found under a bridge near Pigeon Creek in Pottawatomie County. Over the next several months, agencies worked to find her killer, but the case went cold. Evidence collected in 1983 stayed, preserved at the sheriff's office this entire time, waiting for a new lead, and in November of 2020, it did. Christensen is being charged with murder in the first degree and is being held on a $1 million cash-only bond. If you have any information on this case or Christensen, please contact the Pottawatomie County Sheriff's Office. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swain, back to the mid-40s overnight, so on the cool side, mainly clear skies, but a touch warmer than where we've been thanks to winds out of the southeast 5 to 15 miles per hour. Part of that continues into Friday. That'll push our temperatures back to the 70 degree mark, some of the warmest we've seen since our very warm weekend. Skies stay clear to end the week, not so much for the weekend. Rain chances return for the second half of Saturday. Looks like late afternoon, evening, and overnight. Temperatures take another hit. Many of us back to the low 60s and that continuing into a good portion of next week. Mid 60s, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday with an isolated rain chance. Another run at 70 by the time we get to Thursday. Partly cloudy skies expected by then. Godfather's Pizza's Taco Pie's got a new sidekick. Cinnamon Sugar Churro Bites. Add your favorite one topping pizza and you've got my new Taco Feast with Churro Bites. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.